Oh, I guess I'm gonna light it. But what a good backdrop for this video, right? <laughs> Have you ever been so pressured into something that you made a decision that is not you? Have you ever said something to make a group happy or a person happy? And then when you went home, you're like, that's not quite me. That's not who I am. I'm asking you today to change that to always be you do you know how much power confidence does for the human being when we're confident when we don't sway when we know what we believe and we know who we are you know how powerful that is it is the strongest thing in this world to be who you are. So many people ask, like, how do you and Jen do it? How are you all so great together? We know who we are. We're confident. We're proud of each other. We don't sway. In our lives, there's so many times that we're put, what we think is pushed into a corner. In our house, nobody puts baby in a corner. You don't get pressured. People might act like they do, but you're the one confined to them. You're the one that is allowing them to take control. Never let that happen. Be you. Always stay true to you. I want to step back though real quick. Because when I say that, I'm not saying don't ever listen to anybody. Don't ever see another side. That's not what this is about. What this is about is listening and seeing others' perspective, but staying true to who you are. Don't say the words out of your mouth just to please someone else. That's not the way to live. That's not the way to do it. There's so many folks in this world that depending on the group that they're around, they have a different statement de depending on what group it is. And it blows my mind because we all see it. Like, what are you doing? What is that? You said this to this group. You're saying this to that group. Who are you? Which one are you? We don't know. Well, we're here to watch the show, I guess. All I know is my true values. I'm talking about everything. Not anything in particular. I know who I am. Jen know who she is. And we know what we're creating our kids to be. Doesn't matter if you think they're right or wrong. We know what we're doing. We think it's right. And that's all that matters. You're not going to change my mind. I will listen to you. I value your opinion. You're not going to change my words. I'm not going to say things just to make you happy. And the biggest thing about this video is perspective. We have to be able to see each other's perspective. We're a homesteading family out here in the country, middle of nowhere. It is thunder and lightning all over the place right now. Doesn't worry me. I know it's gonna be a great thing for this garden behind me. I don't see much else. But I watch, I listen, I hear, I value it. But on my core values are this right here. Right here, everything that you see. It's the most important thing in my life my family, and this land. So if I ever get put in a spot where that challenges something of that, you might not like what you hear. But that's okay, right? 
I might not like what you have to say. That's the beautiful part of the human race is we don't have to agree. We don't have to, but we have to respect each other. It's the most important part, respect. Everyone sees things through a different lens. We have to learn to respect one another and respect that I can't push you to believe the way I believe and vice versa. If you don't respect it, that's okay too. But don't stay, move on. Just like I do, I would move on. Golden rule, golden rule. Treat others as you would like to be treated. Plain and simple. It's the simplest thing in the book. If we could all act that way, be a much better place. The whole world. It sounds so silly, right? Like, oh, obviously, if we all just did that, it'd be great. Yeah, but the more we preach it, maybe the more hear it. Hear it louder. Keep saying it. Do your children know the golden rule? Do their friends know the golden rule? I know we were all taught it. We start to get this assumption that these things are just known, right? They're just known. The world's telling us it's not. We have to learn to respect each other and know that it is okay to not have the same values and the same views on every single topic there is. We don't have to convince each other on everything that we do on social media. We can share our opinions and then respect others' opinions because that's how we learn. That's how we grow. That's how we become a better world. It's starting to rain. It's been a wild night. I just want to share with you all the passion that I have for everyone to listen to one another. We can all get along as long as that we can respect that we're different and we have different opinions. Stay true to you and don't change just because the environment is changing. Be you, but always respect. Respect your brother. Respect your sister, your neighbors, your family, your friends, and everyone on social media that you don't truly know, but you think you might. Yeah. Every. Go ahead. I think my biggest thing is before you get on your high horse, always realize there's another perspective than yours out there. Um, what you see does not equal what someone else sees. They're walking a different path in life than you are, and that's the case for everyone. Um, you can see. Multiple people at Walmart, you can see people at Save a Lot. I don't care where you go. Thunder rolls. Yeah, I said, let that be true. <laughs> let that be true. <laughs> um, but everyone is walking a path that you can never see. And that includes everyone. That includes everything that's happening in our world. COVID-19, that includes protesters. Um, everyone out there speaking their truth is a truth that you might not understand. Right. So before you get on your high horse, step back and listen to their truth before you speak on it. Because it is not your truth, it is their truth. Don't judge them. Don't pretend that you have walked a day in their shoes. Step back and listen and let them speak to you before you sit there and judge yourself and get on your high horse and try to act like you know every perspective in this world. I promise you, you don't. That's right. Your way is not the only right way. There's right. so many views in life and there's, that's what makes us great. That's what makes this world beautiful is that we all don't see life in the same lens. So open your ears, open your heart, and shut your mouth. I'm not going to share my lighting. But what a good backdrop for this video, right? <laughs> yeah, seriously, we love you all. We, uh, the people that watch our videos, I mean, we can't say enough. You are what we're talking about. 
For anyone that maybe came across this video, I hope somehow it opened your heart a little bit more. Uh, don't pressure someone. Listen. Be softer. Yes. Love. Love is all that matters in this world. And as soon as you love and you listen, we're in a better place in this world. Yeah. Fine. All right, y'all. We're in a thunderstorm. Kevin. If you haven't subscribed, <laughs> subscribe down below. Help me. Help me. Help me hold you. Woo. All right, we love y'all. Until the next one. Bye. Bye.